Hey everyone, this is the Codger. My new channel is Panhead Gaming. Can't totally give up the motorcycle thing. But this channel will be all about gaming. No motorcycle stuff. But there will be a nod to it. Hey, look at this. I'm kind of in the desert. But anyways, this is the Engineering the Apocalypse's Uncut Challenge. So, the challenge. What it is, it's 20 minute days. Max horde of 64 zombies. Horde every night. And it is permadeath. Other than that, it's uh, vanilla settings. So let me get my bearings here. And I'll um, get back to you. Well, another part of the challenge, I should say, is that it's on cut. So you get to see everything. So I'm not just getting back to you exactly. I'm telling you I'm going to stop talking so I can concentrate. Okay. Now, in the beginning quest, they're supposed to have these little icons where stones show up. And feathers and things like that. Wood. It's interesting to look around and not see much of anything. Kind of in the desert here, which I kind of like. It means a higher loot stage if I end up going that way. Okay. Campfire, okay. Okay, wait a second. Scrap this piece of paper. And we are going to burn it. Because the hell with the dupe. Okay, I see my uh, crater's eight bazillion miles away, so... I shouldn't say exactly 8 billion. Hey, that's pretty cool. But you know what to hell with the trader. We're just going to go towards the desert because... I would rather start in the desert. Because the loot stage is higher. The thing you gotta look out for is dingoes and, uh, and vultures. Let's get some more arrows on the craft. Let's spend our skill points since we're at that point. And yep, I'm gonna do this. Two points in strength, two points in sexual Tyrannosaurus. Next point will go into Pummel Pete. Because that's where I'm most comfortable, and in a challenge, I'm going to take every advantage I can. I realize I'm going away from the trader. But like I said, I really don't want to start there, so in the pine forest or the forest, whatever you want, to, the green forest. Okay, I do kind of want to make a shovel, so... There 
There's some iron. What the hell house is that? That is actually a level one POI. Very familiar with it. There's a little trick to it. I kind of want to make a shovel. Make some more stone arrows. Now the trick to this one is, there's a way down into it. It's a little hard to tell where that is right here. Did I make a shovel? Of course not. Oh, look at that, a deer. That would be pretty handy right now. Of course, I missed it. I think I need to aim a little up. There we go. Took a couple of tries, but there we have it. A little bit of meat. And at least we get a narrow back. Okay. Well, wow, all of them. Or almost all of them. I suppose I could make a bone knife. There we go. Eleven more meat. Okay, so the trick to this POI, this is where the main loot is, is down under here. You can kind of see that that looks a little bit different than uh, the desert ground. Now, if you're in a different biome, it's still going to show that. If you're in the wasteland or something, I think it would be more evident. But you see, there's, well, there's an opening here. Gaming After 50 likes to do these uh, shorts that uh, show you sneaky loot. Well, here's some sneaky loot. I don't know if she's done this one. If she has, well, here's another example of it. Now, what we need is a way out. Because there's going to be a, probably a higher tier zombie in here. Yeah, and since it's the desert, well, there you go. Yeah, we got soldiers right away. Let's try to get the hazmat guy first. Of course, I whiffed it. That was a good shot, though. What the hell? That's going to make him a little angry. But nice thing, we already have a flaming club, so... And we did do sneak damage on him. This is at warrior difficulty. I think there's another zombie coming too. Just a bow though. More interested in the uh, soldier right now, though. Okay, the soldier's dead. Bow is on fire. Not a big deal. Pick up our arrow. Now, there might be one more zombie in here. I don't think so. Now we have this whole area to ourselves. Unless something crawls down in here with us. Okay, that could be handy. Murky water's not bad right now. Take that, because why not? Had to hate that. Okay. I'm not going to waste my time with that right now. The 
leather we're going to need, so I'll waste my time with that. The leather you need for uh, a forge, so you should take that where you can early game. Day one type of stuff. We'll wear that because we got nothing else. I'm sure we'll get rid of that pretty soon. Okay, a book. Things to grade 20% slower or however slow. Pipe shotgun, I guess we'll repair it. Maybe we'll use it, maybe we won't. We'll bring it down just in case. Shotgun Messiah box. Let's hopefully. Let's hope that it gives me something worth having. Armor pissing ammunition for the um, Magnum. And we'll keep those. But we're going to scrap the bolt. And we're going to get rid of the nitrate. We'll get rid of that. Let's see, we can put this on something. We'll put it on here. We eat the peas. Scrap the can. Okay, there's a lot of resources down here. Oh, more leather. We'll scrap that, throw that, and throw that. We do want the bones, though. So what I'm going to do here, since it's going on 2100, so I'm going to climb up this. Dig this up. And use this tree house as a... Day one hoard. Well, there's something I don't care about. But it does have ammo, so I guess we'll pull it out. It's a little bit better than the pipe shotgun, if you ask me, but not a lot. Iron arrows, what are we missing? Feathers, okay. I knew I'd be missing something. I think we'll probably make this place our base. I'm not sure. No, don't count on it. Well, look at that. Happen. Feathers delivered right to my doorstep. That looked to be the horde. I don't have any damage, so I'm assuming that's the horde at this point. Thirty feathers, that's not bad. Now problem with using a this as a horde basis is the tree. You'd have to protect the tree. Okay, let's turn these and arrows. And the rest of them into stone arrows. Because early game that's fine. Let's see, did we get a point? I'm sure we did not. But the next point, I think we'll go into Pummel Pete. Or Advanced Engineering for the Forge. Probably Pummel Pete because, uh, well, that would just be better, I think, at this point. Wow. This isn't what I call difficult, so... And it's nothing really worth getting excited about. Okay, I'm not crouch. I'm not crouched, so let's do this. So you can walk right up there. Let's take care of this Bernie boy. And 
pretty sure the next zombie is way back there in a different room. Let's get some resources. Okay, more rocks. That's not bad. Okay, time will go really fast at night here, so you don't have to watch me do this for too much longer. Wow, that was exciting. Um, okay, now we're going to have a runner and a crawler. Thing is, when they come running at you, the thing is not to panic. Just wait for them to get to you. Even if they whack you one, you still got an opportunity to hit them. If your health is good, at least. My timing is fairly decent with the club, so... That kind of thing. One running zombie. whoop de doop -de. Now, if you're a new player, that might make you panic. But here's the thing. Don't let it panic you. Just remain calm as you can. And you should be able to handle it. If it's just one. Might be another zombie in there. Some zombies aren't set to spawn every time, depending on the sleeper volume. So sometimes things show up and sometimes they don't. Nope, mustn't be nothing in here. But while I'm finishing my day, this has been Codger. You can follow me on Twitter at Rider Codger Game. I would like to remind all bikers to keep the shiny side up and ride safe. I want to remind everyone else to live your best life. And to everyone, please thank a veteran or active service member for their service. They have earned your respect and gratitude. They really have. So do that. Have a great one. Man, what bike do I ride? The fat boy? Or the low rider? I don't really know. Probably the fat boy. The low rider's a lot of fun, but I'll tell you what you can do. You can like, comment, and subscribe, and share. While I try to decide which one I'm gonna ride. It's the best problem to have.